What's up guys, it's Nigel and Drill Peter back with a video and I'm back with Marvel Spider-Man. I'm continue where I left off. So let's continue. <laughs> The first and close, follow my instruction. No need for an introduction. Here for some man to save you. My voice is meant to hear you. Can't, Can't believe Shocker's loose again. again. You might have heard about the robbery at Roseman's auction house. What you probably didn't hear, but my sources confirm, is that the perpetrators were wearing masks. Horrible, demonic faces. Yet another example of the explosion in mass criminals since Spider-Man came on the scene. Let's hear your thoughts. You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. Yeah, I see your point, but Spider-Man is not those guys today. Saying he's like them because he wears a mask isn't fair. It's like... Prejudice. Wrong! Here's a little lesson in the English language, my friend. Prejudice means to prejudge someone from... Before you know anything about them, I know all I need to about Spider-Man. He runs around causing chaos, wearing a mask so he doesn't have to answer for his shenanigans, and a flashy costume so he gets attention to feed his gigantic, insatiable ego. Now, if I'm a mentally unstable person, and I see him getting all this coverage, what am I going to do? It's called copycat behavior, people, and it's ruining New York. I've got eyes on a fist construction site, and their equipment covered in dust. Just there for show? That's my bet. I'm gonna take a closer look. Get him. 
web bad guys and quit. And I'm all out of quit. We'll take you alive or dead. Captain, I've got fist disguise and all the probable cause you need, webbed up and waiting. Good job. Fisk thinks he can run things from inside, but he's gonna find out why long-distance relationships don't work out. Ever-loving stuffing out of dealers is my anti-drug. You gonna vote for Osborne? Gotta split before the cops get here. Never know how they'll react to me.
fellas. You can't keep ducking income tax like this. Fisk did keep these wannabe pushers in check. Wait a minute, what's that feeling? Do I miss him? <laughs> no. Uh, maybe you can take the hero to pick these. Maybe you miss him. It off. Yuri, this place is full of fist guys with suspicious bulges. Uh, 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 guns! I, I'm, I'm talking about guns. Obviously. I can't order a raid over bulges. Just a hunch, but there might be a public disturbance Everyone's under Cops, Spider-Man, Masha. literally didn't see that coming. Get that, 
when I see a mob rushing toward me, I assume they want to kill me. They always do. Spider-Man. Every worker assigned to that site reported winning big in Atlantic City recently. Quick and dirty way to launder money. Could be where Fisk keeps his cash these days. We shut it down. We'll really put the squeeze on him. I'm working on a warrant. Way ahead. Reinforcements! Great! I was getting kind of sick of these other guys! We get down before he knocks us all out. Keep him on the ground or we don't get a chance. Keep doing that. No! Time to end it. Someone who cares about you like Willie's guys care about getting kicked in the face, and you'll be golden! People won't have any problems here now. And Wilson Fisk's problems just keep adding up. Nice going. Horror movies? Splitting up is always a bad idea. Okay, I still got two more areas to go. This one.
Drug deals and criminals. Oh, come on, fellas. You can't keep ducking income tax like this. Stuffing out of dealers is my anti-drug. Police are on their way. And so am I. He's 
Getting Don't away. Personality, but your shit yeah. is awesome. Can we talk design details? Maybe later. Good work, Spider Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow, that, that might, might be, be the, the nicest, nicest thing you've, you've ever said, said to me. Looks, Looks like, like I got, got some free time. Maybe now's, Maybe a, now's good a good time to look into that mask. mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> Hey, MJ. You're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, yeah. he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here, and I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah, whenever, whatever. So I guess we're talking again. Cool. Well, listen, I'm not the best person to help with relationship problems. It's not like that. I think she's involved with bad people. Rodrigo might be in real trouble. He's scared, but he won't tell me anything. I can check it out. Any idea when he's meeting her next? Tonight, by the detox center in Greenwich. Okay. Don't worry, Carmen. I'll find out what's going on. Detox center's not far. Carmen just sent me Rodrigo's picture. Let's see if I can find it. Rodrigo. He's really nervous. That woman doesn't seem like a girlfriend. I'll get a photo and see if Carmen recognizes her. You better not hold anything back. Why would I? That picture gets up. My life's over. Give me the plans and it won't. Perfect shot. Very nice. Looks good. Remember, tell anyone about this, and I'll leak the photo. Plans. This sounds bigger than I thought. I better follow the blackmailer and find out how big. Carmen, I'm uploading a photo to you. Does this woman look familiar? No, I've never seen her. What are you talking about? Sounds like she's blackmailing him. She mentioned something about plans. My husband works security at a casino in Atlantic City. She could be planning a heist, but I'll need more evidence before I can do anything. Let me know if I can help. All right. I'm gonna see where she's taking the plans. I'll be in touch. Another victim or an accomplice? 
I need a photo. No perches with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the other side of the highway. Getting, getting off. off. Tapping, Tapping into the, into the train, train system should, should help me follow the train's path. Now. Carmen, the blackmailer met some guy under the high line. Sounded like you knew your husband. I'm sending you the photo. That's Deshaun, Rodrigo's best friend from college. He went to prison years ago on a robbery charge. Casino plans and a criminal record. Not a great combination. I need to find out who else is in on it. If they're hitting the casino, they'll need at least a wheelman and a safe cracker. I watch a lot of high school movies. Sounds like it. I'll let you know what I find out. Head over to the subway exit and wait for him to get out. He's heading for that office building. They're on the move.
all the evidence I need. Now I just have to stop that car. Plan falls apart. Hey, Carmen, your husband's pal and his team just had their trip to beautiful Atlantic City canceled. Thank you. I spoke to Rodrigo. That blackmail photo shows him driving the night that Sean committed the robbery. But Rodrigo didn't know about it. He was just picking up his friends. I've got a contact on the force. She'll help Rodrigo, especially if he'll agree to testify about the blackmail. He will. Or I'll show him he needs to be a lot more afraid of me than Deshaun. Thanks, Spider-Man. <laughs> Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. I 
Just ask for some nose strips. You snore like a water buffalo. Doesn't surprise me. You'd know what a snoring water buffalo sounds like. Partnership with restaurants and grocery stores works great. Any surplus food comes right here. Peter. Peter, what can I do for you? I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where'd she find it? I'm really not sure. Why, what is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Why take the risk? True. Oh. Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, makes sense. Demons, huh? Catch your name. Okay, gotta get right. See you soon. Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Can I not just walk around as Peter? Got, Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little spidey work out in the city.
Okay, let's work on another part while I'm waiting. Work on here. Wait, there's a side mission? Where? Story, Mary Jane's investigating. Don't worry, I'll make sure she's careful. Please tell them two are back together. We're talking again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. He's just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I really liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You got a good boss, man. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. Hello? Hello? Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey, what's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally I forgot. forgot. I mean, yeah, I, I, I didn't, didn't forget, forget, forget. I just, I, I'll, I'll, I'll be there soon. soon. This tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker. You're better than this. Ah, <sighs> he's right. How did I lose track of time? me saying this. But I hope you've learned not to hit people. Oh, you're all 
going to jail. Where I bet you'll be as good at breaking out as you were at breaking in. Glad I stopped that. Too many crazy drivers in the city as it is.
vicinity of Devil's Shelter. Nasty yes, car wreck down there. People might be hurt. The rest of the trapped civilians. Just a little more. That's everyone. Thought I was here to help. Thanks. I thought I was dead. thinks he's the next Wilson Fisk. Well, they are going to jail, so... Something wrong? Oh, no, no. I just had to thank you for saving my daughter from those muggers. Uh, when did this happen? Just now. Busy guy like you. I guess it all blurs together, huh? Near the theater on 126 and Powell. She just called and told me. Right. Sorry. Uh, happy to help. I'm glad your daughter's safe. Okay, I wasn't anywhere near there. I should swing by and see what's going on. There's the theater, and the crime scene. I better find out what happened. You're back already? I thought you were checking out that fire. Right. Uh, on my way now. Which way was it again? Last time you went that way. South. Thanks. Got a little turned around. did this isn't a lethal protector. That's promising. Sorry I missed the action. Thanks for keeping us safe, Spider-Man. Someone's impersonating me. It could be the chameleon again. I've got to pick up his trail. 
It does smell like there was a fire in this direction. There's the fire damage. You came back! I can't thank you enough for saving my friend from the fire. I thought she was dead. My pleasure. Look, I want to make sure everyone's safe, but the smoke kind of got to me. Do you remember where I went next? Sorry, I was helping my friend. I think he went back up there. Thanks. I give your friend my best. Whoever faux Spider-Man is, he's helping people. But what he's doing? He used the fire escape. Guess he couldn't copy my web fingers. Wonder if other me left anything behind. Fire extinguisher. Fire extinguisher, huh? Wonder where he left it. Extinguisher. What type of suppressant is in this? ADP. Pretty standard, and easy to track. He got fire suppressant on him. If I key my lenses to track its chemical signature, it should lead me right to Spider-Man 2.0. He's walking normally. No webs, no powers. Which makes what he's doing suicidal. Maybe you know something. Come on, man, lay off! I told you everything! The deal's going down on the roof! No lie! Right, just... You can stay out of trouble. Hope I'm not too late. My doppelganger's got some skills. And he left the drugs. Seems like his intentions are good, even if his methods are nuts. That's gonna leave a mark. People seem to like him. Yeah, I mean me. I mean, this is weird. Yeah. My pleasure, citizens. Excuse me. I hear someone in need. Okay, I do not talk like that. Nobody talks like that. Let him go. Yeah, right. We'll get even more from Mr. Fisk when we bring him your head. Whoa, hey guys! I'm not the real Spider-Man! Not anymore, you're not. Time to even the odds a little. I always knew it was more than one guy. Kill him both! 
I've got this. Go. Did I miss a chance to team up with the real Spider-Man? No way! You know how to fight. I'm a black belt. Teach at car dojo. I just wanted to help him. the legend, you know? Yeah, but when you dress like me, you inherit my enemies. And I've got a lot of enemies. Look out! Four of them! I'll take the ones with guns. You get the rest. You know, if you want to help your community, there's a beast shelter nearby. And I'm sure folks would appreciate free self-defense classes. Good idea. Gotta admit, I'm starting to see the downside of the suit. Place, but if you keep this up, you're gonna get killed. Yeah, I see that now. Don't worry, I'm hanging up the suit. Spider Man, no more. Good call. Besides, you don't need a costume to make a difference. Hey, that's a good line. I'll remember that.
Long time no see. Yeah.
bring your children into the room, friends, because I'm delivering a lesson in Listenable youngsters need to hear. My guest today is a man who learned the hard way that dressing up like Spider-Man is cool. Go ahead, sir. Well, I, I wanted to fight crime and help people. And I'm a big Spider-Man fan, so I put on a costume like his and try to do what he does. Boy, was that a mistake. I almost got killed. Lucky the real Spider-Man saved me. Let me stop you right there because I think the salient point has been made. Emulate Spider-Man in any way, and you will die! Don't do it, kids! And that's another one of Uncle Jonah's life lessons. Jared, trademark that! How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes! <laughs> hey! Hey! What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But, but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work in a secure environment at Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. 
Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> you just took me out of a job. Easy, easy, easy. They, they didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. That's what I said. You took the job? Uh-oh, it's stricken. I could do something to help Doc. Maybe call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. No. Norman never listens to Harry. He even tried to kill funding for his research. Stations is nearby. You should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. There must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. Message about these before he left for you. Pete, hey, I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's gonna shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is too. Well, it's not gonna pay the bills, but. It sounds like it, it means, means a lot, lot to him. To I'll do what, what I, can I can to help. There's like one or two in each location. I've got a couple stations measuring air pollution. The idea is to catch the out what's the word, contaminants, before they reach toxic levels. Between you and me, I think Oscorp wants this to fail because it might show they're polluting. The amount of polycyclic hydrocarbons in the air is way too high. And rising. If it keeps getting worse, people could die. The particles are concentrating in trouble spots, like mini clouds of smog. I'll swing through them and get samples, then trace them to the source. Nasty as they are, I gotta swing right through those clouds. For these clouds to be visible to the naked eye, the level of toxins must be up there. And gotcha! Anyway. Oh, <laughs> feels 
like I'm breathing from a tailpipe. <laughs> Must be freaking these people out. Oh, what else is new? Huh. The toxins coming from two types of cars and a faulty smokestack. I better get photos. Great light on that one. Perfect. <laughs> Best smokestack picture I ever took. The Department of Environmental Protection will take it from here. Maybe I should make a green spider costume for Earth Day. Well, Harry Station just stopped the public health crisis. Oscorp's gonna have a hard time arguing it's not useful. Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Damn! Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bay. Vacuum I created by putting Fisk away. Jameson was right. Demons are my fault. But what were you supposed to do? Let Fisk keep godfathering? Are you okay? You sound even mopier than usual. I think I might have just lost my job. The city, Norman actually, pulled our funding. Oh, Pete. I'm sorry. If Harry were here, he could talk some sense into his dad. You'll find another source. Your work's too important. Thanks, MJ. Talk to you soon. Herman! Herman. Long, Long time, time no see. see. Hey, hey, I'm, I'm no, no lawyer, lawyer, but, but uh, uh, I'm pretty sure that's a parole violation. <laughs> 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 Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Wanna play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb up? Okay, face punch it is. Whoa, your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You wanna fight? Let's fight! Man, can't wait to put you back on my bar so we can talk science. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid, you just stupid. Do not go on. Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? And who determines the ideal ratio of talking versus not talking? Also, how would you measure? 
Words per minute, syllables per second? Or is it more about how many words one uses to express a single thought? It's all so subjective. If you ask me, some people don't talk enough. It's about who their mysterious overlord is. The person they're working for, that kind of thing. Coming your way. Nope, gotta try something else. That hurt me more than him. Stand still. If you ask nicely, maybe. Why isn't that working? Catch! Quick now, we're all good. Okay, now I can do some real damage. Why are you doing this, Herman? Because of my dog! Stop killing! Seriously! 
on demon, uh, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way. Fight with Shocker took a while. Time to catch up on what I've been missing out in the city. Hey, pal. This station tests particulate matter in the air. Now, you probably have some science jargon way to say this, but basically, too much is not good. Hmm. Readings are troubling, but inconsistent. The only way I'll figure out what's going on is to test nearby emissions. But I've got other problems. The sampler's detecting toxic particles. Better check it out. That steam vent's a good place to start. There's something in here that doesn't belong. Let's analyze it. See what a sample from this can tell me. Nitric acid in there too, but also something else. I'm on the right track, just need to keep following the trail. This is more widespread than I thought. The whole neighborhood's in danger from this.
stinks to high heaven. Time to find out what's in it. Sounding so familiar. Mercury with nitrogen and ethanol. Gotta get back on the trail. When this is over, I'll alert the health department so they can check on the local residents. Problem. Caustic chemicals are leaking out of those barrels and into the plumbing. Need to clean up the site fast. Huh. The calcium and silicon in concrete makes it an ideal absorption material. Looks like I'll have to make a mess to fix this mess. One day. Nice. <coughs> Breathing this stuff in? Not good. Last one! Webbing should stop any residual drainage. That could have been way worse. Harry's research station just proved why it needs to stay open. Like the video for say the next part. Yeah, that is going to help.